So I have the Windows 10 uh, disk uh, loaded up. It's just the standard Windows 10 install disk. And there's this issue that's this extremely terrible bug um, with Windows and solid state drives on some on some computers. It seems based on my research that it's mainly AMD computers, um, but I've also seen other people with Intel. Um, so it's a pretty bad Windows bug and it's on the it's on the install disk and the actual operating system once it's installed at least for me it was and so in this video I'm going to show you how you can get the Windows installed to go quicker and then in another video I'm just going to show what I did to fix um, slow speeds on the win actual Windows 10 operating system um, because of the solid state drive bug. So here you can see if I click next and install, look how long it will take to start the setup. And when I installed, I didn't know how to make it go quicker. And so I literally waited 30, 36 plus hours for Windows 10 to install because of this bug. Um, basically everything took forever and so what I'm going to just show you is how you can make it go quicker when you're installing a Windows 10 and this is once I said this is usually for computers with a solid state drive it seems that there is a an issue with power saving um, the power saving thing wants to I guess limit the power to the hard drive causing issues. I've also had other people um, say there's issues with the graphics driver for me I don't think that was the issue um, because it's some power saving issues with the uh, graphics driver but for me I think it was just this issue where the hard drive is or the solid state drive um, when it's in power saving mode it just doesn't give it much power and it's causing in my case it was causing the drive to constantly be resetting at least in the actual Windows operating system I'm not exactly sure if that's what's happening here but it seems like it is it's basically resetting the hard drive restarting the hard drive um, constantly and so here you can see the setup is still trying to start and this is just to show you how slow uh, it, it, it is without the fix so in a second I'm going to cancel this I'm going to reboot and we're going to do it the way to make things go faster so I'm just going to stop it here there's no point in waiting for this Okay, so the first thing in order to make this thing install quicker is uh, make sure that you have the uh, power cable uh, plugged in, the charger plugged in. Um, if not, this won't um, work. So make sure it's plugged in. And then now just click on next. And we could go into the repair and then go into the command prompt. Or you can do shift F10. and it will open up the command prompt. Um, from the command prompt we need to use the power config uh, command. It's power cfg and then if you do this slash question mark it gives you the list of commands. Um, we don't necessarily need that right now but just in case you're wondering. Um, so power cfg we want to do slash well yeah first of all let's do slash list l i s t so i can just show you what we're going to be doing so when i go to list you can see that 
Um, the power mode is on balanced. You can see the star is right next to it. But now if we go and do power CFG slash and then all caps set active and then all caps scheme underscore min minimum and then press enter so now now if I go into power CFG slash list you can see that it changed from balanced to high performance and so we can exit out of this and go into the install now and you'll see that it's going to start up quicker so it, it still takes a little bit of time to start up but it's going to go a lot quicker than it was before and in my case it was taking hours and hours and hours to install Windows it was uh, literally like I said over 30 five hours to install and even after it's installed I had to do some changes uh, before I could even boot up the computer because this bug is so bad um, because it would just freeze up instantly and so I had to fix that and really the way I fix that is almost the same way um, setting it to active okay here you can see that it has already gotten to here and I guarantee you it's going to be a lot quicker so I've already installed Windows but yeah like I was saying it's basically the same thing for um, once you get Windows installed um, to go to the command prompt and, and set the um, power mode uh, but then also there's an issue if you unplug the charger cable that it still is slow it starts starts going slow again and it freezes up and so in the next video I'll just show you what I did to get that fixed hopefully this will help getting Windows installed um, without it taking days um, so hopefully this helps Thanks for watching and subscribe if you like these types of videos.